right. We're doing an art show here at PAL, Pittsburgh Area Art League tonight. Come on into my gallery. So a lot of my work is plain air. Can you tell us what that means? Plain air means painting on site, usually at the scene, wherever the scene may be. Come on in here. We've got, here's my little studio here. And I work with three colors. Three colors plus white. And I try to do everything within that limited palette. This is a painting I did at a marina about two weeks ago. A quick draw painting that I did out in Floyd, Virginia. Uh, which is out in the western part of the state. Uh, and this is in Chincoteague, Virginia. Up near Richmond. And uh, this is out in the western part of, western part of the state. Humpback Bridge and then um, Jackson River. This is a scene in Nottoway County. As you look over the falls, there's a um, reservoir with a bunch of nice rocks that go down, and that's at the bottom of the rocks. This is another Crabtree Falls one. That, that, that the fellow over there actually said that was his favorite one in the oh, show. that's nice. That's and I used to live at the base of this mountain. I used to live right back here behind these trees. This is called Sleeping Indian and Grovant. Like this is the Grovant River. Where is this at? You said you used to live Wyoming, in Wyoming. Out in Jackson, Wyoming. I stood at this rim and looked over and did a sunrise as it as the sun was rising. There was a lady back there that really liked that piece. This is down in the Florida Keys. I did that down in um, Key Largo. And we drove about two hours to get there before the sun was up. And then I just captured it right when the sun was coming up. This is Chincoteague, Virginia. Chincoteague Lighthouse. I've, got a, I've always loved the Florida scene, so I've always gone down to Florida and did some painting. And that's another Florida scene. This is in um, Chincoteague as well. I love marshes, so marshes are always a, a captive audience for me. Yeah, I like that one. And this is a scene in Robbins Marina, which is in um, near Whitestone, Virginia. This is another Chincoteague area. Love this old, I love all the complicated mess of a scene, and that complication is intriguing to me. So, I like to try to see how simple I can paint something, but yet still keep it simple and abstract. But when you step away from it, you, you really get everything comes together. This scene is of a scene in Virginia Beach called a restaurant called Dockside. You may have, if you go to Virginia Beach, if, mm -hmm. if you've gone to Lynn Haven Pier, mm -hmm. Lynn Haven Bridge. This is a scene I just did about two weeks ago in Gloucester, Virginia. We got a real big rainstorm when I was painting this, so I had to kind of go seek shelter, but then get back into painting it after after the lightning storm came through. And I've always loved old shrimp boats. Shrimp boats are, I, I just love the character of an old shrimp boat. So this is down near Charleston. This is an interesting scene. I bought, this is not from a plain air, it's from a studio, the studio. But I really wanted to capture the power of a wave as it crashes into, into rocks. And I love the, the light that was really happening on that. Marina, I woke up one morning and I didn't know how, much, how the weather was gonna be, so, and it was all fog, so I tried to capture that fog. And then at the final part of it, the light really shone through in the fog. Mm -hmm. And who doesn't love a good sunrise? So I just, I've always loved sunrises. And, thought they were intriguing and 
always trying to get an interesting sunrise. I like the simplicity of the scene yeah. and the way that you caught the light. Yeah, yeah, it's, it, it was a fun scene and I really like to push these pinks that are where the sun is hitting on the top of the waves. And, just, and this one won a first place award just like two weeks ago at an event in Gloucester, Virginia. And this is the Wareneck River down in Gloucester. And I did this from a plein air sketch that I have over in the Studio Easel. This beach, I really love the capture of the, how the water and the light is shimmering off the wet mm -hmm. part of the sand. Me too. And this is a twilight. I did this, it was up in Ocean City, Maryland. And the sun had already set, or it was setting at the time, so I wanted to capture that last minute seconds. So, thank you guys for everybody who's collecting my work. It really means so much to me to have you as a, have a piece of me inside your house. Thank you so much. Thank you.